Hi, welcome back to MKS Pipe and Valve in Kansas City. I am Greg Farrow, Steam Specialist, AKA Steam Guy Greg. In today's blast of Steam knowledge, we're gonna be talking about Steam separators. As you can see here, we have installed in our lab a Steam separator. This is what it looks like piped into our system. I also have one here loose to show you. As you can see here in our housing, we've got horizontal threaded connections coming in with flow direction going this way. This is the actual baffle piece that comes in. So this is what it looks like. As you can see, it's coming into about halfway up this housing. So when I remove this baffle, you can see where that's hitting right here where this dot is. And you can see that there's nowhere for the steam to travel across the baffle. So it has to make its way up these three layered tiers here and come across where this hole is to get up to the other side. So you've got clean, dry steam as a gas coming up and around the top, and all the entrained moisture is being forced by the baffles to flow down via gravity and come out the drain, which is piped out of the bottom of your separator. Okay, so this is our live demonstration of wet steam versus dry steam on our demo board. This is a custom separator, steam separator. Flow is coming in, steam flow is coming in from the right, Discharging to the left. This is discharging to atmosphere. So please be careful. Do not try this at home uh, We're gonna have some some live discharge here uh, This is what is gonna look like I've got a I've got a, a Valve open to a steam trap on the drain of this So right now I am gonna have some dry steam once the condensate works its steam and condensate the moisture works its way through here uh, this is going to be dry steam. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to close this. I'm going to flip this switch. What this is going to do is this is going to shut my valve that's going to my trap drain. So now all of the moisture in this is being built up and it's not being allowed to drain. So once I open this valve, I'm going to have a piece of paper that I'm going to put in the discharge once this kind of works its way through. And what this is going to show you is uh, what our wet steam is going to look like. Again, please be very careful and don't try this at home. You can see some of the entrained moisture is going to show up here. You can see how wet that was and how wet this is going to be. Look how, how wet that piece of paper is. That's going to be your wet steam. Now I'm going to shut this and we're going to flip this, this switch. What this is going to do is going to shut my valve, or open my valve rather, and this is going to allow the uh, the drain to go straight to my steam trap. So now we're draining. So now when I open this back up, we're gonna have some dry steam. You can see immediately what, uh, almost immediately how different it looks. So once this uh, makes its way through the pipe, you can really see now what, what our dry steam looks like. And then with a piece of paper, I'll show you how different it is. Look at that, how there's almost no moisture in there. Show you again on this side. That is your dry steam. Thank you for joining us today on our Blast of Steam Knowledge. Please make sure to check out socials and all of our social media below and join us next time.